Never seen it quite like this She be the hottest in town Coming out the twilight lit Yeah Let them know who got the crown Girl who does it like you do Always keep it hondo when you move You don't really want it with her crew Don't need that drama she calls hey hey love good morning welcome back to another vlog i'm starting this vlog with a face beat you already know it's a sunday i mean for last week i kind of did makeup pretty much every day because i had things going on i had to be out of this house every day so yeah some days some weeks i just only do makeup sundays when i'm about to go to church because i had to look <laughs> so how you guys doing hope you guys are doing great it's another blessed day that the lord has made we shall be glad and rejoice in it guys i'm super happy i was telling my kids this morning i'm such i'm in a good mood today i'm such in a, i'm in such a good mood i don't know maybe it's because it's a sunday i'm just feeling grateful happy you know a friend of mine came i did her makeup i was up i was up like six o'clock i had to take my shower tidy up prep take my shower because I was gonna be a close-up with the person I'm doing their makeup so she came I did her makeup she had a she has a family photo shoot this morning so she was here at 7 so I did her makeup once I was done I just like okay since I have makeup displayed let me just quickly beat my face so I'm so happy it was quick to find what I wanted to wear because I had this in mind this total neck sweater I was telling my sister this is what I'm looking for is bad when you stack clothes together because it's always hard to find it you know that's why I'm getting to a point where I really want to declutter you know make sure I'm not stacking things together that way it's easy for me to find because I always know everything I have in my head but when it comes time to locating it it's a struggle so yes guys hope you guys are doing good mental health is good keep it on check make sure you are in the right place think positive stay positive show love and kindness trust me i really don't have it every day some days i'm down there was a week i was just so 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 down there was some days i'm okay some days i'm just feeling down on myself i'm just like not giving myself grace one thing i always try to remind myself how grateful i am give myself some grace you know tell myself i'm okay i'm happy the way i am i know belief and trust in god's timing that's how i try to live my life because sometimes we look at ourselves we're like ah oh, i want to be this way i want to get to this level but i'm not there I always each time yes as a human I will get out of track I will always like try to blame myself you know tell myself oh bye bye you could have been doing this and doing this you could have da, 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 da. but then I'll give myself a slap I'm like girl look around you count your blessings don't you feel blessed what are you talking about you are blessed you're blessed you're blessed and I get back so today I'm in just that mood I'm so happy that's Joey crying if you heard the noise at the background hope he's giving him a bath the rest are ready so I just assisted in getting the boys and the girls like they're close together that he gave the girls assisted the girls and kicking with their shower so yeah 10 3 now usually we like to leave 10 30 10 40 because it's like a 20 minute drive but of course you know your girl want to take some pictures and create some reels so outfit of the day I'll show you guys what I'm wearing in um I'll insert it so you guys can see but I'm carrying this my I'm carrying this coach bag I love 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 it I was like um, maybe it's not appropriate to wear this this season but I'm like who cares I'm wearing pink I'm wearing bright colors so I just want to accessorize with this and I love it I love it guys like guys it's been so crazy for me like I said give yourself some grace tell yourself you're beautiful you're confident you're happy because uh, just a lot going on not that i'm stressed and one thing that's making me so happy too i recently started going back to the gym i haven't been to the gym in months you know i just like but then i got on the scale i realized i've gained like four pounds from when i stopped going to the gym because regardless of me not going to the gym i've been watching out my i've been watching what i eat you know trying not to eat late and still trying to control my portions but i realized i gained like four pounds i'm like girl you need to do something about it and one thing with the gym it keeps me in a positive space it makes me so happy so me going to the gym sometimes it's not just for weight loss but of course your girl want to shed some pounds i was telling my sister i'm looking like good this morning i just feel light maybe i'm not shed it i've not lost any pound but i just feel light just that positive mindset i've only been to the gym one day 
and I'm still gonna go to the later after church, but I feel good, I feel good. So yeah, you go. Let's go downstairs. I wanna take some pictures and then I'll probably eat something. I just told the kids you guys can have cereal. That's what you guys have for today. You know, I'll probably have cereal too, or maybe a fruit bowl, or some granola. I'm not sure, but yeah, and I'm gonna add a blazer or maybe a jacket to just stay warmer. And the kids also have the jackets out. The girls, the boys, I think I need to get that. Whew, motherhood is draining. Trust me, it's draining your girl. It's draining your girl. Don't think I have it all. It's draining. I was telling my friend this morning why I don't have makeup. I was like, I also realized a lot of people are going through the same thing. She was telling me her own struggles, other people's struggles in her circle. Like, you know, I'm like, it's good to speak out. Don't want it. If people want to shame you for what you do or what you, what's going on in your life, don't feel bad. Don't feel bad. You might be helping another person. So never feel bad to share your story, okay? Your girl is drained. Like, this kid that kiss me off sometimes, like, really bad, especially the boys. You know, this morning, yesterday, daddy took them to a uh, council's party, like, monthly meeting. And I instructed Jason. I gave him, he was really good. I gave him the phone to watch for like an hour because I took, I took the phone out. Watch it for an hour and don't take it to the party before you go keep it because i was not home i'm like keep it and he's like yup only for me dressing up the girls today and the girl one of the twins told me came and told me in my ear like jason was playing game at the party really are you not even happy that i'm even giving you the phone i cut you some slack sometimes i just feel bad i'm like okay you've been good let me give you an hour still monitor but you disobeyed and you took it to the party these kids, Lord help us all, help us all. I need strength, I need strength, I need wisdom, I need understanding, better understanding because like the African style beating, I used to do that, but I'm trying to talk more. Better understanding, trying to understand the kids. Like I want to understand them on a one-to-one, -one. know what your needs are, your wants are, what's going on in your mind. I can't get it all, but I try to get involved so I can know you better and know how to go about your issues, you know, because I want you to be good. I want you to be straight. I want you to, one thing I always tell them is there is a time for everything. You might be playing game now, but the next minute it's time for another thing. Move on to something else. Don't be stuck in one thing. Anyways, this is my Sunday rant. I've been rambling, but let's go. Uh, that's you. That can't say not saying that. Really trust you. Like that. Oh, yeah. 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 To church, I need to grab my coffee. The last person didn't lock this door. Where? Oh, it's Santa Claus. Hi, Miss Lee. Hey. Hey. Uh, December 10th? Yes, ma'am. They need to be here at 9 30. Sure. Sure. Okay. Are you going to tell your husband? <laughs> no, no, I got it. I'll be here. <laughs> what? When it's Christmas, and we're going to go to Auntie Karen's house. Where is that? Where does Daddy, she live? Maryland. Maryland? 
Y'all are gonna go up to the snow. The snow's up there. That's gonna be so much fun playing with the snow. Yeah. I want the drama's going to still be here when it's Christmas. Why is Maryland where it's snow? Yeah, you want to sit somewhere and see why you writing on your pants as a little child. That's all that is. Oh, oh, oh. So annoying. Yeah. 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 Joey, they gave you with the biggest scissor. Who are you open? I will open it. Yeah, I know. What is this? I love you. Are you going to practice with Jeff today or no? Maybe, maybe, even if you don't have babies, maybe Kiki, stop that, you do too much. As you can see, your girl is ready. I'm about to head out quickly for a business meeting, meeting up with my business partner in consulting. Yeah, and we're gonna go to the side because they've been working on the side. They've already partitioned. They've been working doing the build out, so it's coming out good together. And we also need my business partner. Now we need to pick a paint color for the party room. So, yeah, oh, I just came up the stairs, feeling tired. So have our business folder file so right here and I'm just carrying my speedy my never full because this can fit it can fit in there so yeah so that's the plan for today today I'll try to carry you guys along since I've already told you guys about what I'm doing so you guys know we're starting up a business I'll carry you guys along see if I can catch all little clips that way you guys can get involved hope you guys are good so i'm not at breakfast i'm gonna carry a fruit cup i made a pre um partition fruit cup so i'm just gonna carry one in yogurt i'm dropping joey to school the others have gone to school already and i'm making me a cup of coffee you guys i've been to going to the gym and i feel really good very positive light headed good i'm really good okay joey's getting each to average each agitated because he's ready he's ready to go i'll talk to you guys later ah. i'm in love with all your lights and your colors i'm in love with all your nights but you've kept me far away from my focus And to my heart I cannot lie Stars made of stars Up above made to fall Stars counting stars And they guide me through the dark Lonely days left in To breathe. Dreams of green and filled with bliss. Life is so much more than this. So, where do you go? 
Um, Sandra. Yes. And your name? Barbara. Barbara, just one moment. I think I'll just sit here and wait for my partner. Just let her. Oh, okay. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. And then she said of, the uh, nectarine. Yeah, I got so it. So those are four ones, right? Uh, the smoothies. No, that's yes. three. Mm -hmm. So you've given lagoon. three smoothie, nectarine, lagoon. And probably either Glacia or Carolina. What do you think? Wh which one? In what family? The blue. Okay, the blue. Take the long way home. Moving on was never harder with knowledge. Of all the things I leave behind I got a new friend in my life that is perfect And you're no longer on my mind Sun, warming sun And my life's just begun Sun, under the sun be fine and you'll be gone when nothing's like As you can see, I'm here at the suit. I just came in. I'm not gonna be here for that long. I just wanted to come see the update. My business partner didn't have time. She had a meeting to go back to. So yeah, I wanted to just come here and see how far they've come. Cause we saw the videos online, but I just wanted to come see it in person. So I'm here right now at the suit. As you can see, ah, uh, looking good, looking good. They they are done with the build out, created the two party rooms, which I'm gonna share with you guys now. Let me see. I need some light. Also, I thought I had time. We took, it was a two hour meeting with our consultant. We had a lot to talk about, catch up after the Thanksgiving break. We just had a lot to talk about. So, yeah, this is it. Let me show you guys. It's kind of dusty in here. I had to put my bag on the floor because it's dusty. Yeah, I did order a mic because I know I'll be talking to you guys more often. So, hopefully, you guys can hear me now. But when you do come, you get a better, um, Better quality, so yeah, this. I was talking to you guys it was like really white so during our meeting after watching the video we want this window to go up and also wider that way when you plan in the party room and we're gonna have like a blind that way if a party is going on we bring it down if it's not going on we use it as display that way you can see inside from the playground to the party room that way you're inspired you're motivated to come celebrate your birthday party so we're gonna have it really nice we also picked out the colors today during our meeting and some other stuff it was like a two-hour meeting really really productive we got a lot done 
So here it's beautiful. The, each wall, we have like four walls. Each wall is gonna have its own color. So yes, guys, that is it. I know it's gonna be like some work to cut this out because it's really, really thick. This wall is thick. They're doing a great job. Oh. This wall is really, really thick. So welcome to Indoor World, guys. Indoor World is here to serve you guys. Come play and create memories that will last a lifetime, okay? You know, we as mothers, my partner and I, we are both mothers, so we know how important it, it is for kids to have a play space where they can interact, mingle, socialize, and also let out that energy. Yeah, you just don't only play, you can learn some things, you can build your motor skills, we'll have a lot of different things to offer for the kids. It's gonna be exciting. Are you excited to see the theme we came up with for this party, for the indoor playground? It's exciting. We've been working for this for more than a year now. You know, going through the right process, having meetings, lawyer signing lease looking for location i just believe like we are blessed with the best location so this is just the beginning support your girl if you're in the memphis area make sure you come check us out <laughs> yeah or recommend someone to us because black owned business women business black owned female business so yeah i love it i love it so we had requested for them to keep these two mirrors for us. They have the doors that they took out, which they still probably gonna use. My guys, I'm struggling with lights. But let's see how, okay, okay. So yes, 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 yes. So that's it, that's the update. I need to run and go pick up my son because I just wanted to come here. I, oh, I should have taken a video with my phone, but we already have a video, so I'm rushing. I can't take a video anymore. But yeah, I mean, the space. We are excited. Little things are coming together. We're placing all this full stuff already, working on our signage, and we're going to have like a wall logo, like a, a name graphic on the wall, something like that. I'm so excited. I'm really excited. It's been a journey. Trust me, it's been stressful. It's been like up and down, but when you see the vision, you keep going. You don't stop. Never give up, okay? Never give up. I can tell you that. Don't give up in anything. If you have a dream, make it come to light. Put in the work. Do what you're supposed to do. So guys, we are here, we are here, ready to, I can't wait, I can't wait. We are kind of in the operating stage right now, but not fully, so we're still working on stuff. Okay. Well, Robbie should be texting me in a few to check if I'm going to pick up Joey, that way so he can start leaving the house. But yes, I'm going to make that. I'm going to create time because I had other things to do. But why would I let my husband leave home, come down to pick up Joey when I can just stop by and pick him and forgo the other things. I can do it another day. It's not like pressing things. And I'll just go back home and continue some work. Yeah, some admin stuff. I need to reach out to some people. Yeah, I'm excited. So I also brought my lunch. Probably I'll just have that now. This fruit bowls. I had like four made nice little leads and I'll have a Greek yogurt but today I'm gonna be using this one this is Joey's favorite I usually buy this and just yeah eat it like that because it comes with like almond um, roast honey roasted salted almond and jack dark chocolate so this is like a low-fat Greek yogurt so I was trying to see how so this is my lunch okay I just want to mix this up before I leave so so complicated all i wanted was your love and it's time and should we break it because i'm not staying anymore i've been waiting here before it is not the first time thinking that you'll change this time no i don't need a heartbreak i don't need to save you because i gotta be you because i gotta be you So that's what I'm gonna have. I had a cup of coffee for 
breakfast and my friend also gave me a protein bar so I'll probably have that later or I'll save it for another day for lunch I'm trying to work on my height my weight you know back on that healthy journey and yes I've been going to the gym and continue to shop bleed 360 our waist trainers and we adding body shapers to eat so check us out on Instagram bleed underscore 360 yeah. mm. oh that accident so guys so hey fam as you can see I made it back home Joey just went inside I'm excited so I'm so hungry despite me having the fruit cup I, I feel really hungry so I'm gonna find me something to eat. I need to jump in a meeting. It's time now. It's 3:20. I have a meeting to join by 3:45. You know, something I need to catch up on. So the kids will be back in about 30 minutes. So I need to do some stuff, get productive, and do some stuff. Do some stuff within those 30 minutes. The work never stops. As soon as they come back, mommy on duty again. Guys, the only time I get rest is when I sleep, or maybe I just decide to take time for myself. You know, but. It's always busy. There's always something to do, be it career-wise, motherhood, livelihood, something, something, something. So that's why I, I talk more on creating a balance because it's very important for us to create a balance. So yeah, I'm just in the garage right now, I'm about to go in. I just needed this space to talk because Joey just turned the TV on, so he's watching something. 